Tonight, the morning begins heartbreak over a four-legged crime fighter after a tense standoff in the woods. Tonight, this memorial here is growing in memory of Volusia County Canine Forest. Glad you're with us tonight. I'm Matt Austin. And I'm Ginger Gadsden. The dog died after taking a bullet in a shootout with a wanted man. That man took a bullet during today's takedown. Eric Sandoval picks up the story from there, all new at 11. Tonight we found out paramedics brought Eddie Powell here to Central Florida Regional Hospital this afternoon after a deputy shot him several times. That brought to an end a search that literally shook a neighborhood. Tonight we watched Volusia County Sheriff's deputies combing this wooded area for evidence. It's the site where they say 34 year old Eddie Durrell Powell hid from them for nearly 20 hours. He reached as though going for a firearm. At that time the officer fired striking him multiple times. A firearm was recovered. Investigators say they will now determine if it was Powell's firearm that killed a Volusia County canine deputy yesterday afternoon during a shootout. As this memorial begins for Forrest tonight, Johnson says his handler is devastated. It's been rough on him. This is his partner, a, a, an animal he raised, an animal that lives in the house with him, a family member. So it's been pretty rough on him. The search for Powell was rough on the people who live in this Deltona neighborhood. It was very scary. We didn't know if the guy was behind our house or what was going on. Mariella and Carlos Rivera tell us they just moved in two weeks ago. They say they didn't sleep much last night and their neighbor said the same. I was worried because I didn't know where he was and there were so many um, cops and the helicopters were where, you know, we locked all the windows. We were just just worried and we found out hundreds of law enforcement officials were actually engaged in this search and the community pitched in to make sure they were fed restaurants and food distributors all delivered food to the area making sure law enforcement was fueled up to find their man we're in sanford tonight eric sandoval news six powell faces several charges including attempted murder and use of a deadly weapon against a police dog